Cancer Singles, welcome to your July reading. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, y'all, if you haven't watched my singles readings before, they are the shortest readings that I do. What I do is pull two separate energies, two different people you could be dealing with this month in love. If one or both looks like a viable option, then I will also pull an outcome for you guys. If you are looking for a longer reading, the monthlies are the longest ones, the weeklies and the singles are the shorter ones. Those are already posted, so check that out as well. First person, Justice. The Two of Cups reversed. Hmm. And the Knight of Coins. Okay, so we have Libra, Cancer, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn here. <clears throat> so this person, I believe is somebody that you already dealt with. Maybe you were in a relationship and broke up or maybe you never made it to that point. Um, but they are ready to come back and kind of balance things out, make things right with you. Now with the Knight of Coins, they are gonna be moving really slow because it is kind of, you know, they have to be cautious because they're kind of afraid that you're not going to like take them back. You're not going to want to deal with them again, but they are coming back in a much better way, much more balanced, much more even able to give you what you give them basically. Um, but it is going to move pretty slow meant to be committed, just really slow and cautious. All right. Outcome. Should you choose to deal with this person? The magician. Well, it's going to be whatever you make it, Cancer. Um, get to manifesting, setting your intentions, making a list of everything that you want in a relationship because this situation right here is whatever you want it to be. Okay? They're going to kind of be following your lead. All right. Let's get you another one, guys. <clears throat> Five of coins, nine of coins, nine of swords reversed. Wow, this I think that this is somebody you already dealt with as well. Or somebody might have ghosted you or you might have ghosted them with this five of coins. We have Taurus, Virgo, and Gemini. Um, but I think it was only because they didn't feel like they had enough to give to you or your connection. So they had to go off and get their shit together, which they've done with the nine of coins. That's like independently wealthy, um, having everything that you need on your own. It is single energy, but it's very, you know, independent. You don't need another person. So that's where they're at. Whereas they weren't like that when they dealt with you before. I don't know why these are both past people, guys. I'm sorry. I know some people hate that shit, but that's what I see. Um, with the Nine of Swords reversed, whatever, if they had any kind of like emotional issues, mental issues, they have resolved that. They really, they've really gotten themselves together here. All right. <clears throat> Let's get you an outcome should you choose to deal with this person. Queen of Cups. There you go. All the love. All right. So that is offering love, um, being emotionally available, emotionally well balanced, you know, loyal, devoted. So that's where they're at. And that's, I mean, I think that's pretty awesome. It's just whatever they did in the past, is it too bad that you can't get past it? I don't know. That's up to you. But um, there you have it, Cancer. You guys take care. Thank you so much for hanging out with me.